Hello. Hello, teacher. Hi. Hi, teacher. How are you tonight? It's really, I'm well. <laughs> I'm very well. Ah, okay, I heard I'm well and I was like, what happened? <laughs> Is it raining in El Salvador? Or has it been raining? Yes. Yeah, right. There's a storm, I think. Okay, well, in my case, I'm very happy to see you again because we almost finished and not because, oh, <laughs> right, you're going to leave right now. I won't see you anymore. So bye. I'm happy. No, <laughs> that's not the reason why. Because we have time and that means that we can talk about other stuff like yeah, a very interesting topic I want us to discuss tonight to practice fluency. So this time I want to participate. Okay, <laughs> so that's why I'm happy because we'll get time to speak. Mm -hmm. And I want to listen to you, listen to what you think. Anyway, let's get things done first. First things first, okay? And that would be, let me see. Yeah, we saw the pronunciation of personality traits, right? Some of the adjectives. So that's what we're going to work with. Let me open this. Hold on. There it is. And I will ask one of you, somebody please take a screenshot of it and send it to a group. Hello, efficient. This one. All right, can, hold on, not yet. Can somebody take a screenshot, please? Please, 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 pretty please, send it to the group. And what I want you to discuss is, is the adjective negative or is it positive? And why? Can it sometimes, for example, can critical sometimes be a positive thing or is it always a negative thing? So that's what I want you to debate, but generate discussion, okay? The most important thing is that you speak a lot, so give your opinion, uh, justify the answer, all right? And when you finish, I also want you to discuss, no, actually we're gonna do it the other way around. So first, I want you to choose three adjectives that describe you and share it with your classmates, all right? Second thing I want you to do is decide if the adjectives here are negative or positive and, and justify the answer. Is that clear? Yes? All righty. Yes. Well, let's practice then. Um, yep. Yeah. Accept the invitation. Here we go. At the end of the night, I rest when he is the class. Hi, Jose. Hi, everyone. Hi. How are you? That describe each one, right? And decide if it's neg negative or positive. Yes. <clears throat> First, three adjectives that describe it, three adjectives from the list, all right? And then okay. you go one by one, deciding as a group if it's positive or negative and justifying the answer. Okay. Ah, okay. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't know. Um, I don't know, Sonny, you are sad? What is the, the activity I connect right uh, now? Oh, okay. okay. No problem. Uh -huh. First you, thing, Sonia, you have to choose three adjectives. Look at the image. All right. Choose okay. three yes. adjectives that describe you, everybody, one by one. And yes. For example, creating. I have Maria. Sentences, teacher. I, I tell sentences or all. 
No, no, no. Just three adjectives that describe you from the ah, okay. from this ah, image. Okay. This image. Okay. And when you finish, okay. you have to analyze one by one, one by one, and decide if it's positive or negative. Why? Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. Thanks. Sure. In my case, I am. You help me a lot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sometimes too. Yeah. I try because uh, I, I have too many. A lot of things I yeah. know, and I'm always, I know, always text Ligia or call Ligia or uh, send emails to Ligia. Ligia, can you help me? And she <laughs> always help me. <laughs> I, uh, creative. Creative. Created, yeah. created, yeah. created, um, uh, always, uh, disorganized, disorganized, <laughs> disorganized, uh, disorganized, yeah, because, uh, they say that, um, Others personally um okay so those tenure. those three adjectives describe you Olga Sorry? those three adjectives describe you yes uh creat creative creative uh -huh. creative and um, that nice is in negative in positive uh, grade. Okay, very good. Roberto, you already said the three that describe you. Yes. Okay. I can't hear you. Speak louder. Generous. Generous. Uh huh. Functional. Sometimes I am late because I am a teacher. I am a accountant teacher. Very good, an accounting teacher. Where do you teach? When I, when I, when I, I am in my class, I, I have to teach. When my students are, are and, and where do you teach? In a university? In a high school. Ah, in a high school. Oh, wow, that's interesting. Okay, very good. Awesome. Uh, so the next activity is decide positive or negative and why, okay? Yeah, because the almost Salvadorians are. Uh, are uh, in my case, I try to be so, before the time that I have to, to be in a place. Okay, it's good. It's a positive, good it's a positive personality. Yeah. Yeah, it shows good that you meeting. respect other people. What? It shows that you respect other people's time. Mm -hmm. yeah, yes. yeah. Are you punctual, Lydia? Well, yeah, I think yeah, but sometimes I get late in some places. Mm. <laughs> but generally, I think yes, yes, I like to be five minutes mm -hmm. before, but sometimes uh, some things uh, crossing your your some, way. Some so things come up. I try That's to. The expression. Some things come up. Some things come up. Uh, mm -hmm. Come okay. up. Okay, and you, Carlos? Are you punctual? Uh, usually, yes, I am punctual. I, wow, okay. I Lydia? You too, right? Yes, in my work, but with my friends, no. <laughs> <laughs> because they are late, so. <laughs> You're selective. Yes. There you said you are punctual. Yeah, I'm punctual. Always. It doesn't matter if. 
it is a formal or an informal date or interview or a flight or if I have to go out with my friends. I usually I am the first in the place that we keep it to meet. Yeah. I hate yeah. waiting, so I, I yes, in Salvador, I used to always be late, so they would wait for me. Thank you. <laughs> so well <laughs> okay, almost finished. Oh. Almost finish, finish, I guess. Yeah. I don't know because I know. Know. we had to. And when you call a call center, you are impatient? Ah, uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Especially if it be his cell or oh, yeah. <laughs> the company, telephone yes, company. He said, Oh, or Tigo. I'm sorry, Arturo. <laughs> I hate okay, Tigo no too, problem. but sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, sorry no because problem. Tigo inter internet is very in in unstable internet. Yeah, it's uh, unstable. In my, in my city, unstable in my city. Unstable. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. I, I think I think that too. <laughs> I changed to Clarin, Claro. And it's very good. It work for me. Don't cry, Arturo. Please don't cry. <laughs> <laughs> don't feel bad, please. Uh, no, no problem. It's not personal. It's not personal. It's only my point of view. <laughs> no, it, 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 it's a good, a good point. Yeah. Okay, I yeah. think I'm going to go back now, guys. Okay. We're back. <laughs> All right, let's let's continue because I don't know. I want us to have more time towards the end of the class. Not not like right now. So forgetful. Let's do this listening activity. Okay. Tell me the answers, guys. I will only play the audio once, so pay close attention and give me the answers right away. Okay, here we go. Listen to four conversations. Then check the adjective that best describes each person. One, a boss. How do you like your new boss? She's okay. I just wish she'd learn to lighten up a little. What do you mean? Oh, she never enjoys a joke. She never laughs. It's hard to even get a smile out of her. Two, a coworker. Look what Mary gave me. Isn't this a great book? Yeah, it is. Mary's so sweet. She's always giving her friends and coworkers presents. I wish there were more people like her in this world. Three, a teacher. What do you think of the new French teacher? Well, she's kind of strange. She's in a good mood one minute and in a terrible mood the next. Four, a relative. Hey, what's wrong? I'm fed up with my brother. It seems as if he's always angry at me about something. Really? Yeah, he gets upset so easily. I don't know what's the matter with him. All right, let's check the answers. How do you like your... Okay, first one, what's the answer, guys? Serious. 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 Okay. <clears throat> a co-worker. Generous. 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 A teacher. Moody. 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 Moody, yes, that's the answer. Moody. Moody, Moody is the mood that changes from sad to happy. Bipolar. Hungry. Hungry, hungry, what? <laughs> That's a state of thing. Uh, yeah. No, not bipolar. Come on. <laughs> a relative? Bad temper. Bad temper. Very good. Okay. Um, now, I'm going to ask you, everyone, because I, I kind of like group conversations too. Now I'm, I'm becoming a fan of them. Um, can you please tell me one adjective from the list that describes you? Just one adjective, everybody. Okay, go ahead. Creative. Creative. Uh huh. Who's Moody? 
Masi, is that you? <laughs> no, she's like, no, don't look at me. Who said Moody? Ah, Vanessa, okay. No. <laughs> Vanessa, you're Moody? No way. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. What is it, Fer? No, 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 no. You said, you said no way. I said yes way. Yes way. Yes way. Fer, you? Probably creative, but creative. I was talking with Lydia, Lydia and Carlos, but sometimes I'm creative to do nice things or, or good things and sometimes to do bad things. Uh, <laughs> you know, creativity yeah. and the way you want to apply it, right? Okay, yeah. Carlos, just tell me the adjective, guys. Come on. Uh huh, Carlos? Impatient. And unmute the microphone. <laughs> Impatient. Okay, Patricia? Impatient. Generous. Aw, Nelson? <laughs> the microphone, guys. Masi, you haven't told me. You're thinking. Uh, In my case, generous. Yes, and... Very, very generous. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Alain, Mariela, Jose, Dolores, Gaby, Roberto. Impatient. Okay. Very impatient. <laughs> In my case, I'm punctual. I'm punctual. Punctual, very good. Punctual. In my case, punctual too. Yes. Good. There are a lot of many, there are a lot of um, punctual people in this class. It's not our culture. <laughs> David, probably not you, but I mean, a lot of people said that they were functional in this class and it's not part of Salvadorian culture. So I'm impressed. <laughs> yeah, okay, very good. Maybe me. <laughs> no, no, like five people I heard saying they were functional. All right, well. New boss. A uh, new topic, guys. Let's move on. Something very easy. Read the objective, please. Anna? By the end of this season, you will learn and understand classes with details. Okay. Very good. Let's watch the video. Pay attention, guys, because I will not explain anything <laughs> after this. <laughs> so pay attention. I will Hi, are you <laughs> okay. ready to introduce a cause or a reason? Stay with us and see how the word because is used. Clauses with because. The word because introduces a cause or reason. I'd make a good journalist because I'm good at writing. I could be a teacher because I'm very creative. I wouldn't want to be a teacher because I'm very impatient. I could never be a stockbroker because I can't make decisions quickly. Ready to listen to the explanation of the use of because? Because is a conjunction that can connect two independent clauses in one sentence. Let's point out that the clause starting with because can come either before or after the main clause. It is okay to say, because I'm good at writing, I would make a good journalist, or I'd make a good journalist because I'm good at writing. Now pay attention on the use of a comma in the first example. No comma is used, however, when because is in the middle of a sentence. Don't forget, the word because answers the question why. Follow the example so you may work on your own. I couldn't be a singer because I have a funny voice. I would be a good teacher because I'm patient. Now tell us why or why not you would or could be a good president. I'd make a So, um, this is very easy. Actually, it's too easy for you. So, um, we're going to make it not more complex, but look, pay attention to this. I need you to use... Uh, 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 hold on. It's in screen. Okay. I need you to use these expressions, all right? I'd make a good... I'd make a... That's it. You can say I make a terrible, I make a great, I make a beautiful, I make a, um, 
an excellent, it doesn't matter, okay? But this expression, I want you to use it. All right, I could be a, all right? I wouldn't want to be a, I could never be a, all right? Those are the expressions that I want you to practice. And then you say, because, you explain the reason why. For example, um, let me, somebody help me here. Let me see, with a clear audio. Lydia. Lydia, do you think that you would make a good teacher? I, I don't think so. Uh, but, uh, you have to use the expression. Everybody use the expression in the answer. Any expression, no. it, depending on how you feel. This, this you can modify. Hold on. Let me put something here. All right. This adjective, you can modify it, guys. So it doesn't matter. So you were saying, Ligia? I don't think so. I, I, I wouldn't. Think, I, I, wouldn't I don't make, think I would make, you can use this. I don't think I would make a good teacher. I, I don't because, think I could make a good teacher because I'm impatient. I'm impatient, very good. Okay, so this green part is what I want you to use depending on how you feel, right? And change the adjective. So what I will do, can somebody take a screenshot please and send it to the group? Please, please, please. Please, I'm waiting. <laughs> and I, where is this? And I will send you a picture too. Thank you, somebody sent it so sweet. All right, here's the other picture. So I'm sending you a picture, guys, with uh, professions and occupations. I want you to discuss each one of them, all right? So fireman, everybody has to say, in my case, I wouldn't want to be a fireman because I'm a chicken, all right? I, <laughs> I, I don't want to get burned or nothing, break my bones. No, no, thank you. So I wouldn't make a good fireman, uh, fire person. Firefighter, I'm going to say, because that is genderless. <laughs> Firefighter. Okay, so that's what you want to discuss. Is that clear? Yeah. All right, awesome. Let's practice then. We're going to do that in smaller groups. Let me see. Yep. Okay, accept the invitation, please. Let's get speaking. Make sure you use the expressions. We can choose all that we want. Let me see. I'm, sorry. I'm looking the image. Okay, I'm sorry. I think, no, I know I can never be a nurse because I'm afraid of blood. Okay, who was that? Um, no, okay. Sorry, I don't listen very well. Ah, uh, uh, sorry, sorry. Uh, well, I'm gonna repeat it. I could be uh, a chef because I really like works with the food or cooks the meal. Ah, okay. You really like what, David? Cook work with the food. After like, what do you use after like? Yes. We're working. Sorry, yes. I forgot it. Okay, don't forget. Very good. Good, good. I could never be a banker because I hate it all. I hate bankers. What? <laughs> <laughs> I work at a bank. <laughs> uh, really? <laughs> oh, no. I don't like no, no. banks. <laughs> I, I always avoid to go to a bus. <laughs> I don't like to see the blue. <laughs> uh, 
there in my case because I I have to use uh, the image in WhatsApp. I could be a nice portman because I like to do because I like take pictures, especially solar uh, mm -hmm. especially to the nature and environment. Yeah. Bye bye. Yeah. Maybe in another life, I wouldn't be a banker. <laughs> <laughs> no, never. <laughs> I will want to be. Um, I will want to be a policeman because I ever have had problems with the authority. The 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 hot weather. <laughs> Hey, I think I could be a, a good journalist because I I I am I am really thoughtful. Okay. I uh, could be a. Uh... Don't like the barbecues. Yes. If I am scared because I don't want to, I don't help them. Because if scared to the fire. Yes, I feel so impotent. How do you say? Impotent. You, you feel incompetent, maybe? You feel uh, incapable, incapable. I'm cap capable. Okay. Yes. yes. And I would like to help, but I don't. But I don't want. But I can't because it's very dangerous. Yeah. Okay. I couldn't be a teacher because I'm impatient and I don't like children too. Oh, yes. In my case, too. <laughs> oh, I'm very impatient with kids. I I I wanted to be a teacher, but I I always said my yes, mind. teacher. <laughs> no, no, I understand. <laughs> I understand what you're saying, but you're saying children. So why limit it to children, right? And when I went to to university, I said I want to teach adults, not children, and and it worked. Okay, <laughs> yeah. So it's not limited to children. Yeah, good point. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when I when I when I study at high school, mm -hmm. I have I had an experience and I don't like I didn't like. What kind of experience? I can hear you, teacher. What kind of experience? Uh, because it's a young uh kids mm -hmm. and they they gritar they Bring yelled in. they yelled yeah, they and i don't like when people yell mm, with yeah. teenagers it's too noisy yes and i had a bad experience i like that okay but at least you, uh, at least you like numbers you try because if you are if you are teaching for a content students, you have to. Yes, I have to practice uh, the numbers. Yeah. To exercise. A and you, teacher. What's the question? I don't know. Use one of the green. <laughs> green expressions and one of the, yeah. the images. Okay. Thank you for giving yeah. me instructions for <laughs> Yeah, because we, we think we we want to hear your opinion. Okay, okay, thank you. Let me see. I would um, okay, for instance I would make a terrible chef because I when I cook it's delicious, right? But I hate cooking. I get tired quickly, so no. <laughs> yes. 
And I would make a, no, I wouldn't want to be a nurse because if I see blood, I feel like, like I'm almost gonna faint. Uh, I'm gonna pass out, yes. So I couldn't do that either. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think we're gonna go back now. Let me see, 35, yeah. Okay, yeah, let's go back. Okay, bye. Alrighty. Let's see, okay. Oh, some groups I didn't see because I didn't see um, Alain, yes. <laughs> Hi again. <laughs> you're bullying me here. Nah, I know you're not. Okay, last thing in the platform before the exam, which we're going to do tomorrow, right? And you have to finish it tonight or tomorrow because I will give you the answer. So definitely it has to be ready before class, like I said in the message before. Okay, so let's go to section 5.13. And uh, the first one here is... I wouldn't want to be a nurse. What is the right answer? I want you to read the the exercise and the answer, please. So a complete one. Dolores, number one. Okay. David. David. Wait, just, just let me open the platform. <laughs> I'm sharing the screen too. Ah, ah, okay. okay. Uh, you want me to show I, this? Yeah. I wouldn't want to be a nurse, well, or a doctor, because I'm not there. Uh, you can be a voice, a voice nurse. Yeah, they're, they're because yeah. I don't like hospitals. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so because, because I don't, I don't like, like hospitals. hospitals, right. Yeah. Next, uh, Roberto. Oh, I won't hear you, right, Roberto? No, no, no. I won't be able to hear you, I know. Okay, Patricia. I like to be a novelist because I love creative writing. Creative writing. Creative writing. Yes, creative writing, very good. Sonia. I... I could never be a, an account. An accountant? Or an accountant? Because I don't see the option. Because I'm terrible with, the num with numbers. Okay, I could never be an accountant because I'm terrible with numbers okay and next nelson i will make a bad waiter um, i have a because i have a terrible memory mm -hmm. very good and finally item I could be a flight attendant because I really flight enjoy attendant. travel. Flight attendant. Flight attendant. Because attend flight attendant. Flight attendant. Flight attendant. Flight attendant. Yeah. I could be a flight attendant. Perfect. Because, that was better. Mm -hmm. Because I really enjoy traveling. Really enjoy traveling. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, the, the thing is, you were not pronouncing T, hi there, sorry, but yeah, and it turns into an R, right? So it's flight attendant. It sounds weird, I know, but that's how you pronounce it. Let's see. Okay, everything is good, and that was the last part of it. So that's it, okay? Tomorrow we'll do the test. Now what we're gonna do, guys, and this is what I told you at the beginning, we're gonna talk about first impressions, okay? So this is more of a speaking practice. 
All right, practice fluency. Let me send you that. Oh, they sent the answers. <laughs> Good. All right, here first impressions. Okay. So look, check the image, guys. The first first image says first impressions, right? And it says when you look at someone, what makes you think they are dangerous? Okay, so in El Salvador, right, you see a person and you say that person is dangerous. Why? We're talking about we're talking about first impressions. So what causes you to feel like that? What are indicators of a person being dangerous, guys? Without knowing them. Tell me. <laughs> uh, I think clothes when are, the people the clothes they wear, Arturo. Yeah. What else? Um, the, uh, he, and when the person looks angry. Looks angry. What else? Mm -hmm. Tattoos. They have tattoos. Yes, you have to be more specific. More specific. MS. <laughs> the face tattoo. Because of the face. Oh, for example, it's according to cut the hair. Ah, the haircut is also important. Okay, what about, um, how do you know that a person is intelligent? On a first impression. Not only <laughs> physically, okay, but it can be anything. It can be anything. It's the first time you meet them. First time you meet them, you talk to them, and how do you know that that person is intelligent? The way how he speaks. Maybe. The way they speak. What else? <laughs> A crazy? Um, no, 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 because... not crazy. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> We're not there yet. Wait, he... <laughs> intelligent still. He can, no, he use uh, glasses though. Hmm. Uh, when people Very wear glasses. <laughs> <laughs> That's a Maybe. misconception, I think. <laughs> but anyway. All right, well, it, that discussion is for you guys but I'll be in the small groups with you. So maybe I will, you know, I will give my, my two cents, meaning my opinion sometimes, all right? So I wanna be there and let's make groups, hold on. Discuss as many questions as you can and with that we'll finish. One second. Hold on. No, it's too big. Okay, accept the invitation. There it is. Hi. I'm sorry. With the people you already know. Mm. Mm. No, wait, 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 wait. We're gonna start with the with this one. First impressions, the one with the topic. Mama. Yeah, yeah. But the second okay, question. Oh, um, yeah. What makes you think a person is crazy? Oh, wow. First okay. impression, guys. Mm -hmm. In some occasions, the clothes. For example, if it's uh, dangerous with his clothes, with the teacher. For example, a greedy, a greedy person. Mm -hmm. Because, for example, a greedy person, I can say is. In my. When I was young. <laughs> Maybe, maybe I I I like to. But in the um, case when you are in a party, you can meet new people. But I now I like to I to hang out with my friends. Like my parties. <laughs> Work a long hours, and also when the person appears 
do rapping is is doesn't go through, uh, and I have a different team. Or maybe when I have, a, for example, a new cell phone, that person really also uh, he or she he has a. Do you think that you in that moment? Yes, I, I think that too. And when the person has not, it's not too close with, with the with other people, with his or her family, or her friends, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, Patricia or Carlos, who want to? Yes, when when they see you, I... it's like that guy has a cell phone or has something that I can take like that. Yeah. What did I say? And if I talk about that, I will sound as a little racist. <laughs> no, David, I want to hear it. Please say it, please. No, no, I, I told her, her that basically when you see a, a person that, uh, that looks like Mm, like campesino or something like that. That they are sorry. Yeah, they yeah. are little. They are little nigga. They are so slim. They come the, her their hair is little weird. They uh, use cheap um, jewelry, something like chains. Yeah, you uh, can you, you can identify them as a gangster or a thief, something like that. Even you, you can see. What in, they have. Yeah, you can see in their eye that they will give you, uh, um, make you something weird. Even their her, their their teeth are yellow. <laughs> <laughs> My teeth are well, yellow, that, and I'm not dangerous. No, no, no. no I I mean, uh, <laughs> I <don't know. laughs> or the eyes, David. I I I told it that the eyes of huh? the people are red. I don't uh, know what they, they drink. No, because they're under well, they the smoke effect a lot. of drugs, exactly. So, so uh, like, because, yeah, the maybe, eyes are always red. That's right. Or okay, they, you, know, they, you know what? They doesn't uh -huh. sleep. I don't know. They maybe might they it? doesn't sleep. They yes, don't they, sleep very well. Sleep. <laughs> it's because yeah. they are aware that about the cops or military <laughs> mm -hmm. or yeah. the they, army in El Salvador. It was important for me because I had forgotten how to identify somebody, but you're right. You're right, it's the haircuts, it's the mm. jewelry, those two are indicators, definitely. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Major, yeah. And how do you say, how do you say the, the marks they have in, in her body? Tattoos. Tattoos. I forget yeah. that word. <laughs> I forgot it. Yeah. They also have, have tattoos. <laughs> so, but no, it's not easy for me. Okay. Um, well, in in my case, I think that well, I prefer to hang out with people uh, that I already know, and uh, uh, depends to uh, up about the the kind of of hangout. And for example, when I I go to to a discotheque or, or I don't know a bar a bar. I prefer uh, hang out with my friends that is people that I not already know. That uh, uh, mm -hmm. uh -huh. mm -hmm. basically Nelson, my case. I did um, uh, meet uh, my first friends. Great. Carlos? In when I meet more. <laughs> You're right. I guess you might. <laughs> I am back. Yeah. Hello, Jose. But you're right. You're right. Yeah, you have to. Concentration. I think this is the first time that you so win anybody. But the most important times, I, I told to Alain that when you have to to know the father or mother 
Oh, your parents. girlfriend or boyfriend? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, these and are your parents say I agree or disagree? Yeah. <laughs> I never have lucky. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's important, like. What are know. the best ways to make a good first impression again? What are the best ways? I think it's the, the, the way that I you talk to anybody. What? The best way, I think, is uh, the, the way that you talk to anybody first time. Yes, or being your yourself. I don't know. Yeah, don't lie about yourself. Don't lie about your life, your world, uh, what you do to... What do uh, you do uh, every day? Yes, I don't know. Uh, you can, uh, the other people, you can feel that you are interested in, in her life, in his or her life. Yeah, only yes. have some interest to say. A lot of people lies and the, the first time that you talk with them, the, <laughs> yeah. you, you yeah, don't yes. know it's really, really say correct things. Uh, or it's, it's true that the people is tell, talking about. Yeah, but a lot of people of here in El Salvador only have a bad impression. For other people only for, I don't know what people wear, for example. It's the first, it's the first, first thing. Bad impression. <laughs> yeah, it's the first impression is if, if the, what the people wear. The haircut, I don't know. It's the first impression, I guess. Yes. And the next the question is, is related. <laughs> Do you make first impressions based on what people were? It depends, I guess. Depends on, yeah. <laughs> depends on the situation. Yes, I don't know, because uh, some boy, for example, uh, use uh, pants, uh, big pants, and, and the way to, to, <laughs> to walk, I don't know. <laughs> you mean like a gang member? Yes. <laughs> yeah. We are Play talking about soya pango. <laughs> In my case, I have a lot of friends who uses heavy metal clothes, oh, heavy, metal. Heavy, heavy metal he heavy t-shirts, heavy metal t-shirts, boots, uh, black pants, long hair. But uh, I have two friends. They make up. <laughs> yeah, actually two. They but they are a doctor and two electrical engineers and, and the most of my friends are engineers and the most of my friends always and heavy metal lovers yeah mm -hmm. metal lovers mm -hmm. okay. what kind of impression it depends uh, no. where is the place right but I think that it's great to meet new people and also hang out with your friends, people that you already know. I, for me, for I pref I like the both case. Yeah, yeah. But in the case, you meet a new, pe new people in a social media, for example, Facebook. Um, for me, um, no. I, I don't like it. Because you don't even know if that person is real. Yeah. <laughs> in my case, in my case, I like to meet in new people. But you have to Alrighty, how did that practice go? Good. Very, very good. Yeah, I was with three girls. 
Me what too, about man. That? Me too. <laughs> boys will be boys. <laughs> David and I are we are blessed. I enjoy the decision. <laughs> you're what? You're pleased. Blessed. Okay. Well, you guys. Um, let me ask you a question because we're gonna finish right now. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Just tell me yes or no. Be honest. Do you make first impressions based on what people wear? Yes. Yes. Be honest. Yes. 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 Everybody? Yes. <laughs> it depends no. on the situation, too. Oh. Okay. If it's a boy or if it's a girl, I think. But. Both, right? Okay, well, we are superficial like that, but I guess, you know, it's another way to survive, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, um, um, I haven't taught you how to pronounce the past, right? So that's pending, and tomorrow is my last chance, so that's definitely happening tomorrow, okay? So be in mm -hmm. class. <laughs> Don't okay. be upset. Okay. All right. And okay. work on the midterm. You have to finish that platform tonight or tomorrow. Okay. okay so okay. make sure you do that. Thank you very much, guys. It was a pleasure seeing you. And wait. Thank you, teacher. Have to take a picture. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. I don't believe. Make uh, sure. Did you take the picture? Yes. Hold David is hungry. <laughs> David, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Give me one second. I need one more yeah, picture. They have to eat. Right here is the other one. One second. Okay. Thank you guys. See you tomorrow. Good night. Bye. 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 Bye.